Welcome to Bob's Vape Reviews. All items in this review were bought by me for the purpose of doing said review. And today we have an MCM mod. I'd like to first give a shout out to Boss Paul, Tom Swan, and Sir Mao. This is the M4H1. This came out. This is the box you'll receive. MCM Mech Mods. Mega Cloud Maker. <laughs> I just made that up. Totally made that up. Mega Cloud Maker. On the back, the Philippine flag. Beautiful. Nothing. Web address. Easiest way to reach MCM is through Facebook. Join their Facebook page. And if you have any questions or any inquiries, they'll be very quick to reply. Slide this open. And what we have is the mod. On the back, you have your COA, the model, Altum, serial number, date, and signature. Hang on to this. Do not lose it. Open it up. First we have the mod. Altum. A little parts kit. And the button, nothing else. Put it off to the side. In the parts kit we get, whoa, you get the M4H1 drip tip. This is a proprietary drip tip, will only fit on MCM Addies. You get this beautiful, beautiful, look at the brass, the machining. This beauty ring is nice. Very nice. Clean. Australian brass. Australian brass is a high grade brass which polishes up to a very high luster. Also used throughout the mod. You have the name of the mod. M4H1. What is that, Bob? Well, Sir Mao loves assault weapons. I love assault weapons. I think everybody loves assault weapons. So this is after the M4A1 assault rifle. So there's your M4. The H1 is for the Halo 1 battery. So this is the one, this is like a mini Halo. Custom 510. Look at that. That is beautiful. That pops. Beautiful machining on the 510. I love that design on the 510. It really make, makes it pop. Screw cap battery. Plenty of ventilation. Look at that. The machining on the body itself is very well done. It's sharp. The button, the fire button, no magnet, no spring. It works on a seesaw principle. It's held in at the bottom and you push. And it makes contact with the upper plate completing the circuit great idea great thinking outside the box boss mao is really well known for that now lately mcm has made mods that are very interchangeable what do i mean this this mod uses the 18650 the 20 or the 2100 series batteries which is nice the screw battery cap some people love it some people hate it i don't mind it the machining, look at that machining. That is really, it's nice, really sweet machining. You can see the thread work inside is beautiful. What MCM is known for. Even the screws, I'm impressed. The screws are handmade. Now I can see the little circle marks from the drill bit to make the slots, but you know what? I'm not gonna take off for that because these are handmade. You don't see that nowadays. Not when it comes to screws. Another big plus I like, you get an 18650 battery adapter, I forgot to mention. Copper. Another thing I love about MCM is these screws go into the brass, not into the Altum or Delrin. And by the way, this is available in Altum, Delrin, and Resin. Really nice. 
nice it comes with these extras the beauty ring you have your serial number at the top here you have the Philippine flag at the bottom beautiful MCM mods Philippines really nice very stunning very light this thing is light light when I say light it's super light let me put this battery cap in and let's take some measurements I like using my ceramic tweezers it makes it easy to go the threading is so buttery soft let's take some measurements now top to bottom 81 One side, 30, the other side, 35, so you can put up to a 30 mm Addy on her. She is hybrid, so remember, battery safety, Ohm's Law. Remember to have good wraps on those batteries. This is not for newbies, know your Ohm's Law also. This is nice. Let's take a weight on her because I'm telling you she is light. Very light. Come on, scale. Work with me here. 77 grams. When I said she was light, she was light. Very light. So like I said, a 30 M M Addy will fit on the top with no overhang. Always put your atomizer on first because this is a hybrid. Wow, nice. You guys, real quick note I want to bring up. People say, Bob, I have a problem with MCM. The switches get hot. I have problems with misfiring. A lot of the times when you have an issue with a mechanical mod, it has to do with your battery grounding. What I recommend is to buy these brass brush right here brass brush I got three of them for 99 peso it's like two dollar American for three of these brushes why because these are soft and it won't scratch the shit out of your brass if you use this what I do is I take this and I go along the edges of the threading to get rid of any dried up juice here in the Philippines they love to put sweetener in their juice and when I say sweetener I mean 20 25 percent sweetener levels Levels that make my... I'm a diabetic. After I vape Filipino-made juice, I have to go do a shot of insulin. Joke. Joke. So I just lightly take it and go over the threads. Also, don't forget to go over your threads in the mod itself. Give it a really quick once through with the threads. That should relieve a lot of your issues and also keep your mod clean. And keep the threads buttery soft like they were made. Look at that. <laughs> All right, so that's just a little tip. Not not for only MCM mods, but all mechanical mods. What am I going to use today? Of course, I'm going to use my Mose 25. So we're going to screw her on first. I use uh, Altum Spacer on the bottom of my Addy, so I don't fuck. Excuse me, I don't scratch up my five tens. So I'm not going to use the beauty ring at this time. But I do put my atomizer on first, and whenever I test or review, I always use the same build. Round wire Kenthal A1 24 gauge. Dual coil. I use that in the same, so I have no issues with... I have the exact same results every time I use it. Threading on the battery cap is unbelievable. Threading on the 510 is beautiful. Tighten it down, give it a little snag. Well, I think I have to adjust my 510. Yes, I do. I have to adjust my 510. So I'm going to back off my battery. And just to cheat, and because I'm making this video live, I'm going to take my spacer out. Make sure you have a 510 with an adjustable... Make sure you have an atomizer with an adjustable 510. And then tighten down your battery. Give it a little snug. Quick response on the trigger. The button is nice 
It's firm button. It's not like really soft, springy button or with magnets, which is real light touch. You need to press this a little bit to complete the circuit, but it does. Let's take a hit. Very nice. This thing hits very well. Quick response with that fire button. I tell you what, very nice. This is a nice mod. Very well made. It is a gorgeous looking mod. It's very light. Oh my god. Very, very light and very small in the hand. I, my hands are not that big. So you can see. Nice. It hits nice and hard. No misfires. I got two mods. Uh, Saturday. It's Monday right now in Manila. So I'm going to be doing two reviews today. And this was one of them. So I used this mod from Saturday until now and I've had no misfires. I've had no issues. Another nice thing about her that you'll, you will love right now being single battery. Single 21700 I have in there. Make sure you have your battery wraps in there good. Make sure you know Ohm's Law. But you can also get this extension. And the extension has two different things you can do. You can use it like this, polish this brass up. This is also made out of Australian brass. I have not had a chance to... Oh, look at that. You got an 18650 adapter. But I found you can also use it like this. Be, take your time, guys. Take your time. You could use it like this. So you have a stacked 21700s, or you can take this off, put the collar back on, Oop, upside down. Take your time, guys. Don't be in a rush. Don't cross thread shit. Line this up, and then tighten the inside too. And that's what she looks like stacked. And it's ridiculous. Please be careful. This is not for newbies. I was late to the party, so I was not able to get an Altum one, but it looks good with the black. Plenty of battery ventilation. Oh my god. Same buttery smooth threading. Look at that. Woohoo! Nice. Now I don't have a series build in my Mose right now, so I'm not going to go trying to fire it when I know it's not right and I'll burn up my cotton that I just put in there. But it does work with no problem and it will blow your head off. It's a lot of power. Threading is just unbelievably nice. That's what MCM is known for though, is their thread threading and their workmanship on their mods. This is thinking outside the box. This is really a nice mod, Sir Mao. Now, what am I gonna give this as a grade? Huh, this is tough because I really don't have any cons to it. Let's put everything to the side here and let's take her apart. Let's take the Addy off. Put it back like this. Screw it back on my SOB Alta, my favorite. Now, when using taking this apart for maintenance, which you're going to have to do with all mechanicals, please use the correct size screwdriver for the screws. Don't use one that's too small. These are made out of brass. This is made out of hardened steel. You will screw these heads of the screws up really bad. But it comes apart quite simple. Very simple. You will be amazed. You got one screw. You have two screw. You have your 510 deck. You have one screw at the bottom. Take your time. 
Don't be in a rush. Your other screw. Here comes your switch. If I can get it out. That's it. Here's your body. Beautiful. Great machining. I can't find any flaws or anything to pick on her. It really is nice. The machine, here's your 510 top. I love that deck. I love that swirl. It looks nice. That's that's a nice, it really is sharp. I like that. Highly polished Australian brass. We got a Delrin cap at the top to protect your battery. The screw holes machined in the side, so you got nothing going into the body of the Altum. I love that. That's great attention to detail. It really is. This is someone that loves what they're doing. When they take the time to think of this. And to screw into the side of the brass and not the Altum body. Here's your switch. It's like a seesaw. It's held in at the bottom. You push at the top and it springs down to touch solid brass really nice 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 inlay with the Altum at the top here that's another attention to detail I don't know if the camera will zoom in that well that's really nice your bottom remember what I said about the brush keep your con keep all your threads nice and clean Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. You do that, you'll have no problems ever to put her back together. It's very simple. Very simple to do. Let's put our switch in first. Maybe we shouldn't. I don't know. Let me see. I go in from the behind, like that. Put the bottom in. You can see on the ring here where the bottom has been gone with the switch. So you could go in like that. Your top falls right in in place like that. Oh my god. You couldn't have a easier mod to take apart. Now with these screws, I like to start them with my finger. Like that. Like that. Start them with my finger. And then I'll go in with the screwdriver, the right size screwdriver, and tighten them down. Now remember, just go a little bit tight. You're not tightening down the cast iron head on some V8 Chevy engine. This has already been machined and is well machined. So you just need to go a little bit and snug it down. Don't go ape shit crazy. Please. That's it. Nice. There's your button. Beautiful. You want to make sure you don't put the one switch upside down. Like I did. Okay, put your screws in. I like to start with my fingers. Put my screw in. I like to start with my finger. Then I use the screwdriver, come back and tighten it down. Just snug. Don't go ape shit crazy again. I have to keep reminding people that because I have a vape shop and I see nightmares that people do the mods. Battery. Oh my god, look at that. Beautiful. Another quality mod from MCM Mega Cloud Maker Philippines. With your extension. I'd have to give this mod setup an 8. A solid 8. This is really, this is, impresses me for a single battery mod. I can't come up with any real cons on this mod. It is a well designed mod and there's nothing to really pick apart on it. The machining is well done. It works wonderful. It fires really nice. The button has a good feel. It's a sharp looking mod. It's thinking outside the box. Some people will pick on the screws. I will not because I'm impressed. I'm really impressed. Anytime somebody takes the time to do that with screws, to make the screws in-house, it means a lot to me. I used to work at Alliance Tool and Die in New York. 
So I, I, I've been in the machine business and machine shop for a little bit of my life and I, I've seen good machining. And this is really nice machining. I'm very impressed. I think you'll be very happy with this. It comes with a whole bunch of add-ons. The beauty ring is beautiful. Being able to use three different battery sizes is unbelievable. The custom matching drip tip. Are you kidding me? It's MCM for you. So, I hope you enjoyed this review. I'll be kicking out another review for MCM. Have a good day. And please like and subscribe. And vape on, vape safe. Thank you.